and it's been a while since we've been up to the gun range for range improvements. It's the last weekend in February 2023. Haven't done too much in the last two months up here. Three months maybe. Still have a marker stake. We got some intermediate sized trees, some large trees, big pine to drop. Then we've got some stumps to roll. We'll level this ground out. Decide on what we want for a pavilion or do we want an actual building. Our brush piles. We've got to cover those with some dirt. Build some berms on the east. On the north. And on the west side. This is going to be our dedicated low power range rim fire and pellet gun course. Fifty yards, and then we'll have intermediate targets, twenty-five yards and less. Uh, indoor pellet guns, I believe that is about sixty or sixty-five feet, like twenty meters that they shoot. So we'll have to give some thoughts to that, whether we want to have some sort of an indoor facility or have something outdoors. Looks like one big tree has got to drop here. Another decent sized one there. I'm going to try to keep that one in the back if we can, as well as this other big oak and the oak with the ribbons around it over here on the northwest side. Try to keep that one as well. I've got most of the big stuff pushed out with the skid loader so far. At least it's moved out enough we can get trucks, trailers in here, get the firewood cut down, get in with the bigger equipment, drop this one saw that up again this one's a pretty decent size oak for size comparison i don't know 30 inches around maybe 36 it's been here for a while about 120 acres total so it just comes down to proper land management where we're going to place all of our ranges buildings we have a 3d walkthrough course for archery that's 30 different targets anywhere from woodchuck to caribou we have an alligator a bear deer we'll change up that range a little bit uh, this orange streamer, this would be our north east corner of the new dedicated 50 yard range. And I believe we are still 20, 25 yards off from our walkthrough course. So we should not have any problems with range interference with archery versus new pellet gun and rim fire grade seems to slope this way to the east so don't think we're gonna have a problem with drainage we'll cut some paths get a transit set up get some elevations take some of this high spot turn that into berms pitch everything back so that we've got good drainage so we don't have low spots and mud pits soil around here is a lot of sand so we've got some topsoil But below that, about 14, 15 inches is a lot of just below sand. So that soil's just been from who knows, century maybe worth of trees dropping, rotting, turning into soil. About to get a work crew going. 
keep on this project so we don't get too far behind for next year. Leave a comment. Thanks for watching. Appreciate the support. Have a good one.